Mr. Speaker, what these documents reveal is a government so obsessed with its image that it failed to heed warnings from inside its own department, warnings that government cuts would impact services available. Our armed forces personnel and veterans knew this. Staff at Veterans Affairs knew this. Conservatives knew this. Yet the government has spent two years denying the truth. Will the minister now acknowledge that these cuts do, in fact, hurt veterans and reverse them immediately? Here, here. The Honourable Parliamentary Secretary to the Minister of Veterans Affairs. Speaker, uh, coming, since coming to office, since 2006, our government has invested over four billion dollars in additional funding, wow. Mr. That's Speaker, incredible. to help Canada's veterans to provide them services and the benefits that they deserve. Mr. Speaker, every single time we have brought forward initiatives to help our veterans, NDP and the Liberals both have voted against every single measure, Mr. Shame Speaker. On. We on this side of the House will continue to stand for Canada's veterans. Here, here, here. The Honourable Member